this one. Made some homemade pizza with my trail food. Have that for breakfast. Good morning, everyone. We slept at, what is this place called? It's the Christmas Rock Baptist Church, I believe. Uh, Pastor Ken let us stay in the fellowship hall, which was such a blessing after getting rained on and it was actually got pretty cold last night. So, well, cold for, you know, Florida. We slept in and had some food and some breakfast and we are getting ready to get back on trail. We kind of pushed hard the past two days. We did, got dropped off to start the 31 mile road walk at 6.15 two days ago. We did 19 miles that night and then yesterday we did 24 miles on trail. So really yesterday, if you count the miles that we did after midnight, we did close to 30 miles yesterday. But we have about 30 miles to Olivo. I think it's such a beautiful day out. I think once we get started hiking, we can get some good miles in, so maybe around 20 or so, but we'll see. Another beautiful day on the Florida Trail. There's the welcome to Christmas sign. And they keep this tree in nativity scene of 24-7. They light the tree every night at, I think the pastor said eight. Quick little coffee and snack break before we get the day started. Christmas RV park. Trail goes right by here somewhere. I love your cow. There's a bison. Whoa. Holy moly. What's he doing? In the woods we go. We've got this little stream we're following. Looks like good water. Update on my head that I hit yesterday. It's definitely still lumpy, but not as bad. It hasn't turned any colors yet, so you can't really notice. I can, but yeah. I'm glad that it's not. I, I was hoping I wouldn't wake up to a black eye, so we're good. <laughs> Ooh, this one's kind of scary. It's up here. Ooh, it's a long way down. <laughs> yeah, this is beautiful. This is a cute little campsite, fish pond campsite. Alright, we decided to take a blue blaze so that we could go through the wetlands area. The trail, I mean, it's not really a difference in mileage, but there's supposed to be a cool um, boardwalk out here. Sorry, my GoPro died. There is some special type of bird that Not So Bad wants to see that lives out here. So we're gonna check it out. It is the weekend, so there are a ton of people out here. And I do not blame them because today is literally perfect. It's mid 70s and the weather just can't get any better than this. You can hear them. This is definitely underwater. <laughs> A lot. Wow. There's 
the boardwalk. Oh, and there's those pink birds. Okay. This is not part of the trail. This is all bonus miles, but this is why we took the blue route so that we could do this little trail and see the birds. Okay, the Orlando Wetlands Preserve is a must stop. This place is so cool. You see so many different kind of birds and then you can take the trail around the lake. Again, this is not the official Florida trail, but a bunch of far out comments said to take it and I'm very happy with our decision to do this little section. So yeah, this is awesome. Beautiful water source. This is the best water source since we've been on trail. Wow, you can see a bunch of lambs and at the bottom shells. Oh, thank you. Thank you. So. <laughs> We have been hiking for, I don't know, um, probably like 10 or, I, I don't know. We've been hiking for a while now. We've been running into all the ultra marathoners and wrong way, uh, not so bad's friend came and she's gonna take not so bad to REI because she needs to get new shoes, but she brought us some bubbly. So we're gonna sit here 
on this bench and uh, hang out for a second. Tripod and I are going to the next campsite. It's about 6.8 away. And then tomorrow we're gonna get picked up. We're actually gonna take a double zero because Wizard is flying in and she's gonna start hiking with us. Okay, we just turned down Whispering Pines Forest Road. And this section's very strange because we just walked down a road and there's literally like mansions all across mm. the, the Florida Trail. So, this way. And now we're just like randomly going back into the woods behind all the mansions to a supposed campground back here. <laughs> it's very interesting. Wiley Dyke Senior Campsite. This ended up being home for the night. We accomplished 16.5 miles today. Another awesome day of hiking. Thank you guys for coming along and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.